Hello, brothers and sisters in Christ. Today is Thursday, April 1st, and it's 9.12 a.m. Thursday, April 1st, is supposedly said to be the actual day that Jesus would have hung on the cross. Let us take some time today to bow our heads and remember that and thank him for his sacrifice. Now, this little report is in all fairness to Nike. All right, remember the report I did on the satanic shoes that stole the Nike uh, check mark, basically? All right. Here, here's uh, Now the End Begins, or NTEB, has an article up that starts off, um, well, starts off up here, but, uh, all right, Nike, oh, this is so disgusting, falling away, Nike sues MSCHF, whatever, I don't know what that stands for, studios for Satan shoes promoted by false teacher Joel Osteen's good buddy demonic rapper Lil Nas X and they got a picture here of them the three of them together it could be photoshopped the shoe is definitely photoshopped. There's no way she's holding on to that. It's in front of her Victoria's face with the pentagram sign on it and a Nike sign. And oh, it's just disgusting. Well, anyway, Nike has issued statements to multimedia outlets, including CNN, clarifying it does not have a relationship with Lil Nas or MSCHF, and that Nike did not design or release these shoes, and we do not endorse them. So if you like Nike shoes, and you determined I'll never buy Nike shoes again, well, now you can feel better about it, because they're saying they never endorsed it. The modified black and red Nike Air Max 97 sneakers adorned with bronze pentagram charm and a drop of human blood in the midsole are the latest customized Nike footwear product to be released by MSCHF. The company also released a pair of custom-made Jesus shoes in 2019. Yeah, I saw them. They're they're just a weird company. Those were white with a little light blue trimming. Um, a little different design than the most, I guess. Jesus shoes. Jesus didn't even wear shoes. Okay, anyway, it goes on to say, Nike is suing the art collective behind the Lil Nas X Satan's shoes that have sparked a social media backlash. As it turns out, Nike had nothing to do with the demonic Satan shoes released by rapper Lil Nas X and the MSCHF product studio yesterday and is now suing to stop the release of the shoes. But the surprises, surprises do not stop there. Now we learn that a false teacher, Joel Osteen, enjoyed the Super Bowl last year with rapper Lil Nas X. Really? They're that close? They sat together at the Super Bowl. Went together, apparently. Or enjoyed it with him. However that worked out. Maybe they both had box seat tickets in that special place for celebrities. And it just so happened they were sitting next to each other. 
I wonder if he gave him the gospel. LOL. Just kidding. You know he did no such thing. Little children. This is a quote from the word of God. It is the last time. And as ye have heard that Antichrist shall come, even now are there many Antichrists. Whereby we know that it is the last time they went out from us, but they were not of us. For if they had been of us, they would no doubt have continued with us. But they went out that they might be made manifest that they were not all of us. That's King James, of course. 1 John 2, 18. If you want to look that up in your own version. Um, people going out saying there, Oh, I belong to such and such a church. And you don't act like you do. You know, that kind of thing. They went out from us, but they were not of us. For if they had been of us, they would no doubt have continued with us. But they went out that they might be made manifest. In other words, make a name for their self, not for Jesus. That they were not all of us. Yeah, they made it clear they were not really of the church of, that follows Jesus Christ. All right, you can uh, go to the description box and read more if you want. Uh, this this is a good publication to sign up for. Um, I still have a bunch of those cards. I got to get rid of them. I just not here. I'm not wasting them here. I I have to get out of my wheelchair and go up. Everybody here has steps. So would y'all say a prayer for me that now that the weather's nicer and we're still here, like maybe this weekend, Saturday, today's, tomorrow's Friday, maybe tomorrow and, and do some tomorrow and some Saturday, I can just slip them in the doors. You know, I just have to climb. I can climb up one set of stairs to get into an apartment building, go down the hall and just slip one in each. And if anybody comes out, I'll say, I'm trying to spread the gospel news before anybody else takes the vaccination. And then I'll have a chance to tell at least one person in the building about that. See? So I, 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 I need, I need strength i need energy and i need boldness in jesus name okay i'll end this here i pray you all have a wonderful day or a wonderful night whenever you happen to see this and with that i'll end it and i'll talk to you again soon